Good afternoon, you're watching MCHSLive.com News Sprint. Today we have a lot of stuff to catch on from the weekend. It's National Theosaurus Day, so let's get started forthward. The Lady Dogs basketball team continued their season over the weekend, and to be honest, it wasn't a good weekend for Lady Dogs fans. The Lady Dogs lost to Cross Creek on Friday and lost by one point to Thompson on Saturday. On a good note, Shea Brown won her got a free throw on Friday and won her 1,000th point of her high school career. The boys basketball team was back in action over the weekend as well, and they dropped a game to Thompson and Cross Creek, but did win against Eagles Landing Christian Academy. Tonight, they will play again as well, but we'll have that later in the show. Saturday, the dogs traveled to White County for their state duels preliminary match. To open the day, they were supposed to face Pierce County, but they forfeited, so the dogs went against White County and knocked off the Warriors. So now, as the Elite Eight, Morgan County travels on, on this Saturday for state. We'll have the whole state tournament live on mchslive.com, presented by Marcos. Now let's change the pace up a little. Here's Miss Stewart from an announce for an announcement with the Latin Club. Hi, my name is Miss Stewart and I'm the Latin teacher here at Morgan County High School and I'm here to talk with you about something that Latin Club members um, and I myself feel very passionate about and we are trying to join the governor's office in preventing human trafficking and what we are wanting to do is to um, make it so that people become uh, trained in spotting potential warning signs of human trafficking and what they can do in the event that they think human trafficking is going on. So we are having an informational meeting on Thursday, January 20th at 6 p.m. in the school's cafe. We would love to have members of the school, high school students, um, teachers, administrators, um, cafeteria staff, um, custodial staff, nurses, anyone and everyone who is um, have, has questions about this um, potential situation that unfortunately is in our community and we want to figure out how to stop it and how to prevent it and you're going to um, undergo a 30 minute video training session and then you will receive a bracelet at the end of our um, discussions and we're going to do questions and um, see what we want to do going forward as a school in trying to keep our people uh, safe and uh, free from harm. So we sure would love to see y'all on Thursday, January 20th at 6 p.m. Thank you so much. If you have any questions about the event, please see Ms. Stewart today. Now back to basketball. The Bulldogs are facing Burke County tonight at home. The girls start at 6 p.m. and the boys tip off at 7.30. Please come out and support the dogs. If you can't make it, we will have it here live at mchslive.com, presented by Marco's Pizza. Well, let's kick it off with the award-winning joke of the day. Of course, it's Theosaurus theme, because, well, what's funnier than a Theosaurus? Pretty much everything. What does a Theosaurus eat for breakfast? A synonym roll. Here's another one for you. What would you do if you bought a blank Theosaurus? Well, there are no words to describe your anger. Thank you for watching. Join us tomorrow from scores and highlights from tonight's basketball game. Have a great day, and as always, go dogs.